<laughs> so here we are, still talking about Usain Bolt trying to play competitive football. <laughs> we can't believe it. And look, we are all aware of Bolt's indomitable spirit and competitiveness, fueled now by his burning desire to play football. <laughs> but as the big man officially begins his training stint with this new Australian club, the new burst of enthusiasm and energy we see Bolt exuding in his football quest, not to mention how physically fit and ready the big man appears to be, since he's so haunted and can't keep still. <laughs> I think Bolt would hit the headlines harder and with more credibility if he decides to make a comeback to the track for next year's World Championships in Qatar. If he's even to run a leg on the sprint relay, people would have taken Bolt more serious. <laughs> right now, even if they're not saying it, people have Bolt and this football thing as a clown thing. <laughs> I mean, Bolt and this big football thing is like me, the Maverick, announcing that I want to become the next Archbishop of the Anglican Church. <laughs> clown thing! <laughs> but if Bolt calls a press conference tomorrow morning and announces, hey, I am fit and ready and will make a return to the track at next year's World Championship, that would be more believable and achievable news. <laughs> On Instagram, that would get enough more views. Plus, <laughs> the Uranian team could not lose. <laughs> right now, boy, the football team are just to keep it amused. <laughs>